Stephen Gerrard is a great example of an American. He um, came here at the opening of the Revolutionary War. Uh, he was a ship, ship captain getting away from the, the British, so he stopped into Philadelphia and he never left. Um, he was a smart guy. He was able to look at uh, the differences and values of commodities at various ports and was able to use that as a leverage to, to make money. Uh, he was involved in um, China trade. Um, he traded opium, not a popular thing, but it did make him money. Um, and then he, he diversified. He, he, he bought land um, and he invested in coal, uh, which was a new material. Coal was a new material from um, up the Schuylkill River, so it was readily available. And in the 20s, 1820s, that became a major uh, export for Philadelphia. So we would send coal all up and down um, the east coast of, of America. And from that, he made a lot of money. And he became the wealthiest man in America. Um, in the end, he um, bought the, sec uh, the, the Bank of America. He made it the Girard Bank um, He during, uh, in 1813. He made a huge loan, uh, arranged a loan of $16 million to the federal government, and 10 of which he loaned from his own personal pocket.